and gentlemen, please welcome Dr. Heather Dees, Chairman of the Board of Management Volkswagen Brand. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and a warm welcome to Volkswagen here at the CES in Las Vegas. I'm Herbert Dies, I'm the new CEO of Volkswagen Brand, and I'm very pleased to kick off the year together with you. A happy new year to you all. Oh, thank you. For more than 60 years, the Volkswagen brand has been at home in the United States. So 60 years have been full of great moments, great emotions, and great successes. And we are proud of it. Of course, the current issue with the diesel engines is certainly nothing to be proud of. We disappointed our customers and the American people, for which I truly I'm truly sorry and for which I apologize. We at Volkswagen are disappointed that this could happen within the company we love. I assure you, we are doing everything we can to make things right. And we are working night and day to find effective technical remedies for our customers and the authorities worldwide. In total, up to 11 million Volkswagen Group cars are affected by this issue. For the large majority of these cars, we have already worked out approved solutions. In Europe, this holds true for about 8.5 million affected cars. The solutions have been ratified by the European authorities and we still and we will want to start to repair these cars already this month. Most of them will be fixed within 2016. Here in the US, the set of regulations is different compared to Europe. It's more demanding in terms of nitrogen oxide and less demanding in terms of CO2. We are working hard to present an acceptable package to the US authorities to CARB and to EPA. And we are confident. We are confident that we will find good solutions for the affected US vehicles and our valued customers. In recent weeks, we have made significant progress. We are preparing a, compreh a comprehensive plan on how to bring about 500,000 affected vehicles here in the US into compliance with the emission regulations. And we are in an ongoing constructive dialogue with EPA and CARB about what is really needed. We greatly appreciate their help and I'm optimistic that we will gain their approval within the coming weeks and months. Once again, we are committed to making things right. And we are focused on ensuring that something like this can never happen again at Volkswagen. But there is a second message we would like to bring to you tonight. We are now creating a different and better company, a new Volkswagen. We are in the process of redefining every aspect of Volkswagen. We are renewing our thinking, our approach, our products, and of course, we are renewing our view of the future of mobility. Thank you. 